Goodbye, this is Luke, director of Vamps and Lun and Unsane. Yo, this your girl Mo. What's happening? What's up? Go, you working with some ass yet? You bad yet? Yeah. <laughs> okay, it's your girl, Little Jim Red. Back at you with the 9 9 and the 2000. Hey, it's your girl, Pixie, aka Pixabella. Bringing you the salsa caliente con sabor latino. And you are lost now. Real forces of sentiment. You got knocked the fuck out, man. Man. Young stuff for life. Hey y'all, it's your girl Little Jen Red, and we're back again with another th- number three podcast with the Real Voices of Sim Entertainment. <laughs> here I have a special guest with us here today, and I want to introduce to y'all to um, a very special friend of mine, my Bessie. <laughs> Yeah, she's uh, uh, the queen of animation. She's been doing animation since uh, 2013, I believe. So that's like about six years. She's an expert. I think she's an expert in it. She's great at it. Um, So we want to welcome to you What The Sims, a.k.a. D. What's up, girl? Hey, y'all. Hey, y'all. Welcome. Thank you. (laughs) So, um, D, tell us... um, Tell us a little bit about yourself, like, you know, um, where you got your inspiration of doing animation. Uh, I got my inspiration from, I guess, TV. I always wanted to do animation since I was young. So, Sims is pretty easy to do it. So, yeah. So, what you mean you want to always do animation since you were young? You're still young, bitch. I mean, come on. Oh, now. yeah. Well, <laughs> well, I was like a kid, a kid. Okay, okay. So you've been, you've been, so when you first worked on your, when was your, you know, you first worked on your animation that was like with The Sims 3? Well, honestly, I guess it was with The Sims 2, but that was too hard. But my successful attempt was with Sims 3. Okay, so it was basically like, if you don't, if you first, you don't succeed, try, try again, that kind of thing. Yes, ma'am. Okay, y'all got any questions for him? Yeah, I wanted to ask, um, how long does it take you to make an animation? It depends. I mean, I guess the quickest would be like 20 to 30 minutes. Oh, okay. 20 to 30 minutes, so you should be you should be already finished with mine that I have been um, That's a couple things. A couple, <laughs> you said, you a couple animation, that just... Oh. Okay, so, so you saying like with the the different types of animations they take a little bit longer yes okay okay i see what you're saying okay so if uh people want to like uh request anything do you do like requests or do you just kind of make up like what's on your mind that day yeah they can request for a fee or join my patreon True, true, true. Was there an option uh, on your Patreon where they can do the request in like a custom animation? Mm, I guess all tiers can do it, but I'll make it faster the higher the tier is. Oh, so my shit should be out. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I can work on it after this, after this podcast. <laughs> after this podcast? <laughs> Like two weeks ago, girl. Come on, now what you doing? No, what do you mean two weeks ago? This was like this week. Don't start. No, I know <laughs> it was this week. All right, <laughs> Mo, do you have a question? Um, my question is, what has been your most difficult animation that you've created, and how did you get through it? Ooh, um... that, that would be mine because she hasn't started, so it's mine. <laughs> Honestly, it probably would be hers. <laughs> um, I'm gonna get through it by looking at references, mm-hmm. and that's pretty much it. So, okay. Oh, okay. So what? Um, uh, what type of animation was it that was most difficult for you? Like, what did you create? <laughs> Um, 
I don't even know. A lot of stuff I do is in art. <laughs> uh, <Lock> it. <laughs> I mean, it really is. Um, yeah, I don't know. When you say when you say your fan your fantasy animation was your the hardest one because you know you did a whole video with that and that was pretty awesome. Well, most of that was just taken from the actual game. I just edited a little bit. Okay. So what is your favorite animation that you've created? Mm, well, I have some unreleased magic ones. I guess those. Okay. Nice. And how do you They're not they're not even Sims 4 or Sims 3. Nice. And how do you like how do you like some uh, animations and to like the uh, people's machinimals? Oh, Can you repeat still... that question, please? Translator! Oh. <laughs> Sorry, I might be hard to understand it. I don't know, because he cut out, so I can't translate that. <laughs> oh, I, I didn't know I cut out. Sorry. Um, I was saying, uh, so how do you like seeing your animations and so like, uh, people's machinimals? I love it. It makes me feel like I helped you guys out. Yeah, definitely Aww, did. she's cause... contributing to the cause. Thank <laughs> you. Yes, I am. <laughs> You're not a lot nicer than me, because I'll just, like, release mine just out of nowhere, and no one knows. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh, what are, what are the plans on, um, uh, your animations going forward? Like, um, what do you feel like, uh, you're gonna improve on, or, like, what do you want to see out of it in the long run? I want to see more action ones. Like, Matrix, kind of. Or, like, Swords. Stuff like that. All right, go ahead and get on the. Oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> you know how hard that is. He's waiting to use it for his, for his series. <laughs> uh, of course. Oh, well, yeah. try as your hand at it once you finish Jennifer animation, because we don't need another body on our hands. Our, and that's our okay. chance. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Um, like I, I want to say, like you know, for those who are listening that you know she you know she does it like you know a patron thing or whatever but i mean like a lot of these these people who does animations they're usually like in college or they're like high school kids or whatever you know really talented kids so it's like you know a dollar or two dollars five dollars even more would go a long way because you know they can you can they can use that money to buy them noodles, you know, ramen noodles, blue noodles. Yes, like, yes. You know? <laughs> yeah, damn right, and coffee. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> we need a lot of coffee, especially me. <laughs> yeah, exactly. So you know, I mean, it doesn't hurt to just give them a little something, and you know, they will turn to favor by giving you an animation. And that's what you know. When I saw her animations, I was just like, I'm going to become a patron of hers because I really like her animations because. She takes her time in it, and she perfected. As you can see, she's taking a whole month to do mine. But yeah, but it's um, only I, it's only been like playing. four days. <laughs> like, uh, uh-uh. I'm just saying, no, no, no. But you know, that's why I invested in her because I like, I like what she do, and you know what, you know what I saw. Like, wow, this girl is really awesome. So you know, I mean, like these people, they, you know, you pay. $150 for a pair of Jordans. Why not give like a little to these people? You know what I'm saying? They're just doing this for you guys, for y'all game to be more entertaining, for you to make machinima of post uh, role plays or whatever. You know what I'm saying? So, All you know, right. give a little. Yeah. So, um, what the Sims for all the listeners? that's listening to the podcast where can they find your animations and become a patreon you can find i think all of my animations on patreon.com slash what the sum or just check out my youtube channel you can find it on the patreon all right so so has there been any uh machinimals that you've been um excited to see your animations in or just like any machinimals you enjoy in general oh (laughs) <laughs> um, ooh. Damn, that's usually a no when they're like, oh, that <laughs> well, no, it's just, I just... <laughs> no, I just can't think right now. Uh, okay. Everyone is a wonderful machinima creator. <laughs> All right, you hear that? She so, thinks so wonderful. 
<laughs> so what would you say to those that want to get into machinima? I mean, not machinima, but animations. What would you say to them, those that want to get started in it? Um, it may look really daunting, but it honestly isn't. Just get a lot of references and you should be good to go. And practice. Yes, and keep practicing. All Don't right. expect to get it one day either. <laughs> but practice nope. the right way. Yes. There we go. Alrighty then. Alright, nope. we'll go ahead and move into the news today. Um, as you guys know, um, I don't know if the guys did Cyber Monday, but apparently most of the Sims uh, expansions were just $20 if you went to your local Best Buy, if you have it. Um, if you're in a different country, I don't know. <laughs> I got my $44 deal, honey. I got me a expansion pack. I got me a... Um... What was the other damn one? They got so many damn game packs. And what was the other one? I forget, but I got me three games. Thank you. I appreciate the news, Lulu. Cause <laughs> if you would have never told me last week, honey, I'll be sitting here looking ugly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then I'm um, pretty sure um, you got the uh, Get Famous, didn't you? Or did you get pets? Uh-uh, no, uh-uh. I'll wait till it's $20, okay? Because it wasn't $20. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, I ain't even update anyway. What? Girl, oh, my God. Uh, you update it. the game. Everything is fixed. You're fine. I can't even play <laughs> the games I just bought, so I have to wait. <laughs> I think she said she won't she won't update until the third episode is out. Yes, and I that I'm working on well, I'll tell y'all that at the closing remarks. Yes. Okay, moving on. Oh boy, so it's confirmed Mo has not updated yet. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh boy. Um and then uh the uh Sim uh the uh Sims 4 Get Famous guide was just released for some reason they need to make a guide if you don't know how to play the Sims 4, but um you know, it's kind of a click and learn thing, so I'm not sure what this guide is supposed to help on. But um yeah, if you wanna get your person up faster or be a YouTube star or actor or whatever they do in there. Um, go ahead Those and use are for that the guide. newbies. Those are for the newbies. <laughs> so yeah, go ahead and use that guide. Um, yep. <laughs> all right. And the next thing is um, console losers. You guys have December fourth, the a Jungle Adventure and Outdoor Retreat is coming to console. Um, anybody excited about that? <laughs> yeah? No. Nah, 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 sorry. Nah. I did that one time and I was sorry. <laughs> yeah, I did it too, and I hated it. Mm -mm. All right. Well, yeah, your Xbox and PlayStation Four people. There you go. All right, and then also, uh, Mo, you're really gonna like this. Um, the uh, Sims Four released a community survey that has one question asking, "How likely is it oh, you would recommend?" No. <laughs> <laughs> it's asking, "How likely is it that you would recommend the Sims Four to a friend or colleague?" And it's a oh. one out of ten, zero out of ten scale um what's everybody's thoughts what's your uh number you would give for that if you wanted to do the survey 10 all right we got one ten, john i'll give him a 10 all right pixel oh what the hell 10 <laughs> all right and uh d oh my god you guys are gonna hate me <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm I'm like, I'm 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 to get everything, it's like four hundred dollars plus. No. Now you got to remember, back in the day when Sims Two came out, that was about the same thing too for that for all expansions. Yeah, it was. Yeah, but, absolutely. But listen, listen, it was worth it. This okay, the two. Yeah, not. I agree that it was worth it. But can you please explain to me when it comes to the three? Three mm -hmm. had an open world, creative style. Sure, it may have been laggy. Maybe it was innovative. Uh uh, they look. No. They walk. <laughs> oh, you about to start Sorry. another rat? Right. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah, this is definitely a rat because right, the right. Sims Three, even though no, 
Sims 3 was shitty. So. Yes. No, no, Sims 3 uh, sucks. Hold on. Hold on. From a machinima point of view, Sims 3, if you get rid of the lag, it's better than 4. Yeah, slow. No, no. What lag? No, 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 no. What lag? Because I'm gonna be lagging, honey. You must have a slow computer. Yeah. I'm saying you get rid of the lag from Sims 3. Nah, I I got a control sweater. It was optimized like shit for Sims 3. Like, my PC could not do it. And I tried. Yes. I have a custom gaming PC. And every time I try to play, um, the Sims 3, and I try to do machinimas on it, it will lag. The only thing I was able to do on the Sims 3 was just freaking take pictures and do poses. <laughs> well, my game works good. So. <laughs> the only thing I liked on so. the Sims 3 was that you could like travel with the car. That was the only cool thing I liked about it. The you open world aspect. Well, that... You need to realize. No, we're not haters. We're just veterans. Before. We're veterans. Exactly. We've been playing the game for a very long time, and we know what are the differences. I've been playing for fourteen years. Just 18. remember, we all have 18, our own opinions. Boo-boo. Doesn't mean <laughs> yes. you have to agree. We can agree <laughs> to disagree. Exactly. Let's, let's, hey, let's all agree though. They they lighten ball of skin. Can we can we talk about that? <laughs> <laughs> to me, my opinion, I think The Sims 4 is way better when it comes to filming because it's easier to get into the Where's game. Where's the slow-mo? Where's the slow-mo? Because if the game starts lagging, like if you film on a potato, it's Where not- does it lag? No, where does it lag? Where does it lag? Like You, can, you put in a lot lagging. of CC and you don't have a gaming computer, it's just not going to be a good time. So why would you play it on a non-gaming computer? A lot right? of people do. But- <laughs> yeah, some people and have no choice, also- to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but that's also an option where you can merge your CC and you can get rid of your lag. So I if you're not merging for Sims 4, didn't do anything. Mm. Mm. No, well. the um, even with uh, the vanilla stuff, because I remember I had a crappier PC that was playing the Sims 3 on when it first came out. It, that was still light. Like, it, it was not optimized for a lot. Sims 3 PCs. had a lot of issues. Even EA Games said it. Sims 3 had a lot of issues. And it did. that's why they, they always disabled. Sims 4. That's did, why, but... yeah, Sims 3 had a lot of issues, and that's why they created the Sims 4 the way they did, and they made it more computer and laptop friendly. They made because... it more cartoony. Sims Actually, it was like a, a DS game. And then the characters had all of them had fat faces. Like, come on. Yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But yeah. have you looked at the Sims with custom content? The Sims 3, in order for The Sims 3 to look good, you had to download a hell of a lot of CC to make the characters look good. And The Sims 4, you don't really have to do that that much. And we got a god worry. If you want to have it look realistic, yes, you do. Okay, it's, are we in the news or are we ranting? <laughs> I think we're ranting. All right, yeah, so ranting. what else you got for the news, Lou? Oh, uh, um, actually, that was... Oh, well, I gotta get my uh, writing on it. Um, and, you know, mine's isn't gonna be a 10 either. I mean, it's not gonna be a low like a 2. But <laughs> the reason why, I, I'm definitely gonna give it my honest opinion. And it's gonna be a 7, and for many reasons. One, uh, I do like the game. Like, it runs so much smoother, like, even on a low-end PC. Like, you can have a GTX 750 graphics card. I know a lot of people don't know what that is, but that's not, like, very high. Cool. Addo, addo. Okay, but yeah, you, you can run, you can run Ultra on my, okay, but yeah, um, so you could run it great on my, and I liked how getting the CC was a lot easier than 3, because 3, I would like, download CC using that installer, or whatever the hell that shit was, and mm-hmm. I didn't, my CC sometimes didn't even show up in the game, so I'm like, what the fuck is wrong with this game? Yeah. So, like, Sims 4, I like CC use, I like how I can just go into the gallery and pick up, like, mostly anything I want, you know, hopefully that I got the CC that that person has, and all that. Uh, the reason I don't like it is I, I ha- how they release these like game packs. Like this is terrible. Like we didn't get seasons so what four years in since it started. And what about the toddlers? Yeah, the tall. Yeah, that mm-hmm. too. The toddlers didn't even start. And we didn't get pools when it started either. So I'm like, all they cared about was putting a fucking eating plant, man, eating plant. Like who wants that? Nobody cared. <laughs> Nobody cared but you about know that. Which game did have toddlers and a pool base game? Sims three. Three and two. 
Three and two. And we still waiting on cars. EA, what the fuck is this? Yeah, and I don't like that it doesn't have the open world, so that's another point while it would go down. Like, I, I don't like that I have to make a whole college campus by putting one thing in one area and relying on the 64 by 64 lots. Like, that, that gets so annoying after a while, and then, like... When you run out of buildings and like a city to build, you can't even really build a city because San Mushuno is like the closest thing you can get to if you're like in a want a city environment. Well, now you have to assault. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I mean, and I like, I think Mushuno is a lot easier to make in Sims 4, to be honest, because like, all I gotta do is just hit my tab key and then set my camera because uh, I only use two numbers anyway. So, it, they it made it a lot easier to get thought done out of the way. Now, I do wish we had Rockstar's editor from GTA 5. Like, for those that don't know that, it's pretty much you just hit record and you put the actions, like, let them do what you're doing, like, move a character. And then you can change hit the camera record. inside there. Um, and you change, yeah, you change the camera inside, like, the actual editor in the game. So, like, if you're saying, oh, the camera should be over here, you can just put it over there and you can follow it like a character or do whatever you want. You can make... A lot more better stuff, and I think a Rockstar has the most powerful editor, and I wish The Sims would, like, steal that or incorporate it into the game. <laughs> you know? But, because, you know, he is greedy as hell, so I don't see why they didn't do it yet. <laughs> they're not gonna listen to it. Just, they like, you got your money. Oh, shit. Yep, and EA not listening is another reason why we're now at seven. So that's three points taken away. What the fuck? <laughs> 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 Well, I mean, if it wasn't for the modders, you know what I'm saying, that make the game much more fun, then, you know, I yes. probably Absolutely. Mm -hmm. yes, yeah, I, I think agree. mods, I believe, is like the only thing saving this game franchise, to I be know. honest. Yeah. They helped me release my stress when I was able to go kill a couple Sims. <laughs> 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 Hey, what's that guy name? I forgot his name, but he came out with a new mod which is gonna help me with my next series. Of that professional? Yes. Oh, he got nope. a car running over a sim. Yes, boo. What? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You gotta get that girl. Bro, yeah. You better lick it, lick it, boo boo. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> Actually, a car coming running, like a car is driving, and he hit the sim. Like, mm. I was like, and that's in my storyline. I'm like, oh yeah, I'm gonna. I already got it. And <laughs> <laughs> don't tell too much information. Don't tell too oh. much information. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> don't tell too much info, girl. Girl, it's Get on, it's on, it's on. Spo Okay. All right. Spoiler alert. Go ahead, Jen. Spoiler alert. Okay. So KYC <laughs> got another line. Where it's it's a uh, beauty salon, so you know, in in fam, it get famous. You know, they have like stylists, but it's like when I went to go play for mine, because you know, mine's is like you know the beauty salon or whatever, mm -hmm. and you can't really like um, I don't know, you only like if you're like famous or something, you get your shit done. Well, she made a mod where anybody can get their stuff done and makeup. Uh, you can get waxing your. Your eyeballs like she got a lot of stuff on there, and I'm like, okay, Shit. but you need you need to send it to me because yes, that waxing right? Huh? Can, can it be a Brazilian yeah. wax? What's I was up? just gonna ask. <laughs> <laughs> she, she got a lot of she got a lot of stuff on there, and actually, it's gonna be released to the public on December the twelfth. Okay, so, well, let me know. I mean, not the twelfth, the second. I'm sorry, my bad, the second. That's, That's tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, like I said, without the modders, like, it, I mean, EA game, y'all pretty much, but like, I don't think y'all will, anybody will buy y'all game because the models just making, making the best. And then y'all trying to come out with this new update, make it hard for them to, like, you know, do they, they scripts and stuff. But they hate it, they came out harder. So, hey, you know. Oh, yeah. yeah. You know what? I know I thought it was going to be one rhyme, but I've got something else now. Now that you said that, I should have put this back in there. Okay. Let's, let's, uh, and I'll put the timestamp. This will be another rant. Um, do you guys feel EA is trying to, like, shut down the modders and all that with their new stupid updates? Like, especially with them switching the, um, engine on this one. Uh, start with Jen. Of course they are. Like, like I said, the modders, they, it's only because people. People play 
The Sims 4 only because they come out with so much stuff. Like Little Miss Sam, she came out with a whole bunch of stuff. KY Stacy came out with a whole bunch of stuff. The other guy, I keep forgetting his name, Sacrificial. Sacrificial. Yeah, he came out with all these great ass models. Came out with so much stuff, and so EA like Sacrificial came out with. I think he had a a model called Get Famous or something like that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. and then EA, yeah, EA Games came out with it too, so they already know, like, they taking over and they just like, man, we gotta do something to, like, kind of shut them down to, like, and, you know, they wasn't going for that, like, the models, like, shit, we, computer typing up shit and stuff, like, we got y'all motherfuckers, hold up, we got y'all, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> What's that, can't yeah, shut down code like, anyway. Yeah, like, you know, like, they got hooked on that shit fast, so it's like, no, come on, EA Games, like, shut it down, shut it down. Mm. Right, um, yeah, it's kind of like, uh, going off what you were saying, like, they can keep trying to, like, put all these updates out, but, like, they're gonna keep overriding their code every time, like, it's not hard for these modders, this is what they do, probably for a living, making it off of Patreon and all that. Hackers, so, hackers, hackers. Right, you know, uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh, <I'm laughs> hackers, hackers. <laughs> but but yeah um you know overall it's just kind of weird and coincidental how they like come out with the stuff like right when the new bucket of smart comes out and then they like say oh we're making an update and they update the game and everybody's mods just break so you know like i said they can keep trying to hold us down but like this is probably why i don't they don't support us machine mods either because we always keep making stuff with mods <laughs> <laughs> but they can keep doing their updates. They can keep doing whatever it is that they're doing. It's not going to stop the modders because obviously they just proved it. You know, as soon as that new update came up, the modders, they were on point. They, they were on it. They updated um their mods. They did what they needed to do. And us that use the, the mods and stuff, we were back on the game again. It didn't stop them. Nothing. So they can keep continue to keep doing the little stupid ass updates that make no damn sense. You know, but it's not going to stop them. You know, they're going to keep doing their thing. Now, what my request is, modders, is um, try to figure out how to put cars up in there. Because, you know, I really need cars. So, can you try, you know, figure out how to do it? Right. Because by the time we wait for EA to do it, I'm going to grow white hairs already. So, you know. <laughs> we need movable so. cars. You, they did have a model that came out with cars, but it wasn't movable. You know, like yeah, it wasn't moving. Right, like, we don't want to do that green screen shit over and over. <laughs> yeah, nah, I don't want to do that either. Yeah, my green shit is, is a piece of shit. So. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm tired of doing the green screening. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you can lazy with this shit. It's time consuming. It's time consuming. You gotta do little steps here or there, and then you gotta place the sims with the teleporter. Oh my oh goodness! My like, don't get me started. You know, so somebody please, you know, hook us up. Yeah. You know. Well, I'm gonna add my little two cent. Um, the update. Oh, <laughs> I say. Fuck origin. Where the fuck did you come from? Because you was non existent. For real. Sims 2 and fucking Sims 3. Like, since when we have to be connected online for fucking updates? Okay. When oh can I God. go back to where I just pop in my motherfucking CD disc and yeah. play my goddamn game? Go back. Yes. Okay. Go back. Preach it, sister. Yes, honey. Like, can we get back to the old ways? Okay. Right. Okay, because I feel like we living in our last days with these damn Sims. <laughs> so, whatever is going on, y'all need to hurry up and rectify that shit real quick. And that's all I got to say about it. Right, they, right. Did, they, they did that shit online because they don't want people to go with other people they CDs and stuff. You know, they want people to buy into that shit. That's yeah, of course, uh, Sims 3, all you needed was the serial code, and you can use it on anybody's thing. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah. All right. D, what's your thoughts on that? Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, about which thing, origin or the Python? Uh, either one, either one. Um, yeah, that update didn't seem necessary. I don't know why that was a thing. Um, it's just EA being EA again. Uh, origin, I don't like origin, I don't. 
Well, I don't use it. He he he. Oh yeah, you, you old school. All right, that's right. No, I mean like I just downloaded these games. <laughs> Oh, so you're a pirate? Yes. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh. oh, power confirm. All right. Mm-hmm. <laughs> all right, and no, we got. I can afford all the Sims Four stuff. Okay. No, no problem. I bought mine in like bundles. I like went to those key sites for like uh, GTA or G Two A and uh, King Nguyen. I don't know. Uh, I forgot what those sites are called, but I just bought them in bundle packs. I was like, I'm not paying single for single one. Um, people should do that more. Yes, if you want to save money, do that. Well, half the people that know why exist because Origin didn't even advertise that they were bundled. But that's how they get you. They don't do that. Yeah, it's kind of fucked up. All right, uh, now I got news coming in. Uh, just this just came in. Oh, Lord. Open it in the <laughs> <laughs> All right, no, <laughs> no surprise today. Um, <laughs> the, uh, God, I'm gonna fuck his name up. Uh, Jor Gahak. Um, the stat- Joy Gahak. <laughs> Translation. <laughs> Joy Gahak. Alright, we'll call him Joy for now. Um, looks like he posted in the general chat of the uh, SIF, the uh, Sims Film Festival, for those that don't know, that, um, you can enter your projects if they're completed now, but the entries are opening March 1st, so March 1st will be the next contest, so... Uh, anyone got- anyone entering? Hmm? Any thoughts? Mm. Okay, uh, Sims so Fest- that- I might answer. What, 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 like, what's the categories? I mean, that's everything. It's like, um, doing your, sh- you can put your shows, you can make a movie for it. Um, I think, like, there's one where, like, people were recreating video game scenes or something on the thing. So, you know, Dean okay, can could probably be, answer can that. Can it be explicit? Can it be explicit? Yeah, from where I go, I think you have to just put in the beginning of the video that it's going to have adult features in it. And I think it should be good. Oh, okay. Hey, Jennifer, that's why I Jennifer. wasn't. That's why I wasn't gonna be a part of it because you know my Jennifer. stuff is eight and over. Oh, yeah, that's the reason why I wasn't it in the past because be I didn't want to like. Child, put why it in. are you whispering? Jennifer, <laughs> Jennifer check it up. Oh, we all okay there? <laughs> oh yeah, we we good, we good. All right, and uh, D, are you looking forward to making a lot of animations when that season rolls around? <laughs> yeah, I will. I will. All right, so you know, you guys all better hit her up though uh, for March first because yep. it's gonna get busy. <laughs> nah, she had to be my shit first though before she start on anybody else. Oh god! <laughs> <laughs> she got it sick of your shit. <laughs> <laughs> hey, she she stuck with me for life, G. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. All right, uh, I swear you out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, kill the music. I, <laughs> I like it Irish. And I'm here to tell you how it's good. All right. We first got to start it off for the year 2008. Capricorn. Woo! Cappy. Yeah. You are too calculated for the people around you. The reason why you get ahead is not because you're not smart or because you are not perfect. You are the perfect con. Karma mm. is all around you and is watching you. Oh, an unfortunate day this week, you will step on a cow duel. So <laughs> watch where you're going. You know, you're definitely going to step, uh, step in cow shit. So. Yeah. Damn. And he's a con. You full of shit, Lou. <laughs> <laughs> How old are you? Oh, I don't know. It's unknown. It's a- Where you from? Oh, I don't know. It's unknown. Oh, that's are you human? Unknown. No, I'm an alien. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> Aquarius. Focus yeah. on one thing in your life once. Stop being a flake and actually do the thing you promised people. Communicate skills will communicate skills this week are worsened by baboon. I don't know what the fuck that word is. Speak up! <laughs> and Malak, what the fuck? Well, Aquarius, you know what I'm saying? Like, y'all don't have no people skills, so focus on your communication and stop talking to people any kind of way. Fucking suck. All right, Pisces, <laughs> you need to come back to Earth. 
Wait, what the fuck? D, what are you? What what's your sign, girl? I'm you an Aries. Huh? I'm an Aries. Oh uh, no wonder. <laughs> no, I'm stuck. <laughs> okay. Pisces. You need Yay. to go Daydreaming in Mexico. <laughs> <laughs> Next out your credit card won't make you happy. Oh, that's why I'm broke, man. <laughs> Spend all those sums. <laughs> I know I'm broke. Will alcohol penis drown you in your sorrow? How you know I'm drinking right now, man? Mm, you are popular among your friends. <laughs> 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 you are popular among your friends because you have fresh stash. Bitch, you got money? Make it rain. Make sure you stop daydreaming before you walk into traffic. Mm, I'm going to kill myself, y'all. <laughs> you don't hear from me, you know what happened. Jennifer killed me. She ran me over her vehicle. Oh, Lord. <laughs> yeah, blind the motor. <laughs> <laughs> Aries, your impossible uh, nature gets you in a lot of trouble. It has always <laughs> created a hole in your pocket. Mm. Ooh. Mm, yes. Too Do much schoolwork. No. Favor. Get on that bus that goes nowhere. There will be surely a way out. Somebody's going to be showing you a way out while you're trying to find your way back home. Uh, The angel will be stuck in your head. So. <laughs> Tired. You are often called stubborn. Oh, Lord, yes, they are. The reason for you want to win an argument. Oh, yes, they do. Mm -hmm. even, even with a child. Now, that's bad. Even with a child. With Boy, you're going to bust your child. head. You will always be chased by. <laughs> you will always be chased by the street. Dog on the way home this week. Keep your eyes open. So if that straight dog coming after your ass, you better run. Gemini. The voices in your head are getting louder. Your neighbors are starting to notice. Your positive karma cycle is all is all wrong kinds of stuff. You will spot your crush in the love of your life with someone else. All right. Yeah, I'm silent on that one. <laughs> Cancer. Whoa, yeah. Whoa, yeah, yeah. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I'll just get some <laughs> bot shit. <laughs> hey, hold on. You, you got to start over. She's overpowering your voice right now. I said I'm coming for you. <laughs> you, that? Right. you need to stop crying about that water about why that way about that lost oh. dick you're breaking up i can't hear you yeah mo you're like talking over i don't want to speak <laughs> can y'all hear me yes okay cancer you need to stop crying about that waiter who gave you cold food your crabs are moody <laughs> 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 Bitch, you got crab. No! <laughs> Damn. Your crabs are moody enough to make you stale cheese. Damn. Oh. Ow! <laughs> Why we always got botcha every time? <laughs> damn, damn, damn. Whatever. <laughs> you claim yourself to be wonder, a wanderer and a dreamer. Mm, sounds familiar. However, <laughs> you never leave your stinky shell to do anything risky or new. To make things worth, a a crow will shit on you. What? Damn. <clears throat> um, <clears throat> <clears throat> um, sort of. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so, so I don't know what the fuck you going through, but Pixarello, I'm talking to you. Oh, All shut right. up. <laughs> <laughs> You will miss all your deadlines this week while you're running to be on time for that one for that one meeting your shoes fall apart. 
Also, a child beggar on the street will harass you until you lose your faith in humanity. Please, sir, can I have some more? <laughs> Translation. Please, can I have some more? You need to. Are we gonna move? On? Are we gonna move on to Leo, Libra? All right, Libra. <laughs> Libra, talking your way out of problems does not mean problems are resolved. When you're done deciding what to eat for lunch you need to get back to life your constant confusion is slowly clearing if it isn't bad enough your data will run out be unbe noticed scorpion scorpio there is one thing you love more than your reflection your photographs strangers will think you are mysterious but they don't realize you are a creep waiting to be found out you need to think you are smooth and can be the life of the party but you aren't getting invited to the right ones oh, <laughs> this week practice less being a creep that's so fucking true all right <laughs> <laughs> Sagittarius you hate people telling you what to do however Rarely you do anything other than claim you you take your own path, even if Google Apple Maps <laughs> even if Google Apple Maps is showing you that you are heading towards a landfill. <laughs> the story, characters, and incidents portrayed in the purely fictionist and not to be taken seriously. Mm. Mm -hmm. And <laughs> I'm gonna go back to Virgo because y'all totally me missed that shit. And they still didn't get it. Okay, well, anyway. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> she losing everybody, bro. Oh, no, they were all right? here. <laughs> Virgo, you will need you need to stop waiting for your mom to clean your laundry. You stink literally. You, yeah. your watchman thinks of garbage collectors whenever you're around. Take a shower, <laughs> and planet the planet of favor. Be weary of Wednesdays. You might get stuck. Uh, you might get stuck in a lift. Bitch, please. <laughs> you stink. You stink. Bitch, you I don't stink. Play. I take a fucking. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, I want to see my motherfucking bird, my my horoscope with y'all because y'all wasn't listening. Mm. And you were coming and going. Girl, whatever. Uh, and that would complete the horoscope of Irish. Oh, right. Oh, right. Oh, right. One thing I, I realized, does the Sims 4 do the um, Zodiacs anymore? I didn't pay attention. No! I just realized that when we were just doing this now. <laughs> uh -huh. Doing the what? Remember how you had like the Zodiac sign you could choose for your Sim? Like, I think it was like, it was one, oh, two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, I just yeah, noticed yeah. I don't do that now. That's weird. All right. Oh, well, moving on to some uh, Sim letters. Sim letter. Sim letter. <laughs> all right, guys. To all the listeners here, we have the Sim letter segment. If you need some advice from our crew, uh, Luby, Momo, okay, Jin Jin, and Pixie, you're welcome to submit. A sim letter to simtainment at gmail.com. All right, so today's sim letter is titled, I think my husband, oh, I said it so wrong. Sorry, the drink kicking in. <clears throat> I'm going to start it over. <laughs> <laughs> I think my husband is cheating. All right. Dear Mo and the real voices of simtainment. I've been trying to figure out why this stranger showed up at my doorstep out of the blue in the midst of one of my intimate moments with my man. I mean, it's not often we would have amazing sex. Soon as I would return home, unexpectedly due to my flight cancellation, I noticed a bottle of wine with several glasses upon returning home in my kitchen. But I didn't think nothing 
of it. <laughs> Considering he did have a stressful week. And since I was leaving, he probably wanted to unwind. And he reassured me that it was nothing. <laughs> he insisted. He take me out for a bite to eat. But I wanted dessert instead. The sex was amazing. Better than usual, might I add. He can be kinky at times. <laughs> Fantasizing about us being watched by a peeping Tom or under investigation with the room being wired where everyone could hear us. He really knows how to put it on me until there was a knock at my door. And it was some guy from some sort of cheaters investigation agency named Joey Greco and asked if my husband could possibly have an affair. Oh shit. In that moment, I'm trying to figure out how he knows I have a husband. And before I could respond, he immediately leaves. I find it to be very strange. I haven't talked to my husband about it because I don't want to assume he's cheating without evidence. The wine and glasses are questionable at this point. It was only him at the house when I left, and no one was there when I returned. Or was it? What should I do at this point? Could my husband possibly be cheating? Or am I thinking irrationally? Sincerely, a concern, Jocelyn. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so I'm going to return this as first. Ow, ow, um, ow, as yo, you yo. can see. Oh, sorry. As you can see, Jocelyn has questions. She thinks her husband is cheating on her. She doesn't want to jump to conclusions, but there's a hunch and she has questions. So starting with Jen, what advice could you give Jocelyn? Jocelyn, open up your fucking eyes, girl. Like if your intuition is telling you that your man is fucking cheating, bitch, cheating on your ass. Uh, you know, I would just follow my first mind and go with it. So, you know, I mean, hey, if there's, if you know there's problems in your relationship, try to solve them and fix them. Okay, cool, cool. All right, Lulu. Oh, uh, yeah, just kind of piggyback on off of that. Like, obviously, you got the instincts. Um, you know, let your instincts kick in. It's not wrong with being paranoid about it, especially if you know what's happening and Joey Greco shows up at your door. <laughs> all right pixie well yeah just you know open that mouth speak up <laughs> tell him how you're feeling and what you're thinking Ooh, i can't <laughs> <laughs> all right our special guest d what advice would you give our um writer is this a real story <laughs> 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 Just give the advice, child. <laughs> yeah, he, he, he has to go. <laughs> you hear that, Jocelyn? Oh, he has to go. It's <laughs> the bus lighter ever. <laughs> <laughs> Jocelyn, <laughs> you ready to be a single mother? Fuck no, that bitch ain't going nowhere. <laughs> it doesn't say she's a mother. Is she's a mother? She didn't write that in her letter. Oh, uh, we're just a solo. <laughs> so, oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, uh, um, is that everybody? Well, or you gotta give yours. I mean, I just say to you, Jocelyn, honey, um, a woman's tuition is everything. If you feel like something's fishy about this, you may want to do some investigation. Matter of fact, you may want to Google cheaters and find out if you can reach Joey. I mean, you have the information there. Reach, reach out to him. Find out what's going on. Like this is, this is bizarre, okay? Cause like, girl, honey, somebody show up my door. Uh, hold up, bro. Cause I will be packing and I'll be coming straight to you real quick with the quickness um maybe you need to question him like if you feel it like you really need to and it's really bothering you maybe you need to address it with him like seriously like come on did you 
go go smell his drawers. Go see if something <laughs> kind of off. <laughs> see if something kind of off. You know what I'm saying? So you know, don't beat yourself up about it. You know, I'm the 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 preaching guru. Like pray about it. Pray on that thing. Uh, if you need to go seek some sort of comfort with friends, family that you trust and you can confide in, you know, go talk to them about it, you know, but um, this is all advice we can give you, honey just just follow your intuition that's it. Yes, talk to him, talk to your friends, get it off Alright Alright, and then moving on next to Smart Ass Questions Oh yeah, we got Smart Ass Questions <laughs> Uh, a lot of y'all think you're smart, but you might be dumber. <laughs> Shut up. You're the uh, dumb one. <laughs> oh, yes, I am, honey. That's the reason why I'm asking you questions, girl. Yes. Girl. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. Oh, God. All right, and She's D, uh, feel free speaker. to participate with my answers on this one, T. Yes. Okay, so first question. What do you call male ballerina? Brown beef. <laughs> ballerina. <laughs> um, uh, the football what player. Pix- what was Pixie answer? I don't know. Right. Oh, you can't Google this. I'm like, it's it's, it's <laughs> male ballerinas. Bat- no ballet dancer, but that's not the answer, so I don't know. Oh, you're gonna say Batman for some reason. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay, FYI, I don't know the answer either. I'm just asking questions. Okay. Uh, uh, right. uh. The next question. So it's pretty much whatever answer you feel that's suited for the question. Prima ballerina. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> <I can't. laughs> okay, here we go. If you fart and burp at the same time, would it make a vacuum in your tummy? No. <laughs> Have anyone tried it? No. No. <laughs> Alright, can can we can we all try it right now? What? No. <laughs> I'm not gassy right now. Damn. See, girl, I you get gassy at night when I'm sleeping. I, I gotta wait till I sleep in order for me to be gassy, okay? All right, I well, am not adding sound effects. And then you do it. I'm not adding sound effects. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I am not. You added the burp. That is cross. Oh, man. Okay. All right, moving on to the next thing. <laughs> 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 Moving on to uh, uh, what's going on and update our cast productions here. Um, we're going to all talk about just what, what what's coming forward and uh, what we're working on. So uh, you curious people that want to bother us and ask us when the next episode is, it's a chance to hear it now. So pay attention. Uh, starting with Jen. Jen, what you got coming in? <laughs> <laughs> oh, keep repeating it because they keep asking. Yeah. I mean, I'm just waiting on my voiceover. I got I got a couple of them in already. Um, Brandon, he's so fantastic. He turned he turned his lines and um, oh, so shot at me. <laughs> Rachel turned her lines too, but I I told her she had to do them over because I was like, girl, you gotta bring it. So she gonna do them over again for me or whatever. People love me, you know what I'm saying? Everybody loves me. Yeah. So anyway, um, I I want to. At least, because I know it's it's a big project, but I at least want to put out something in the middle of December. You know, something with the Christmas um, scene with it. But I am working on, um, like, I'm doing a lot of postings with uh, the Real Voices of Sim Entertainment. I'm doing, like, these little, um, you know, uh, I don't know what to call them, role plays that this with us. Yeah. And I, um, one day I'm hoping to make a little video, like a one minute video of us, you know, talking, um, something for you guys to see or whatever. So, you know, that's that's my creation and that's what I'm coming up with. All right. Awesome. All right, all right. And uh, Pixel, what's coming up? Uh, 
Um, I just recently posted the episode three promo of Judas Kiss. So make sure you go to my YouTube channel and check that out. It's out there. It confused a lot of people. Um, because they thought it was actual the full episode and it's not it was just a promo <laughs> um but episode three is coming really soon i'm editing editing it but as you know it takes a little time and you know with real life and stuff like that it gets in the way so it tends to push me back and then my game was acting up was being a bitch to me but anyway i digress um so yeah so the promo's out for the third episode check it out on pixarella and um the third episode should be out sometime um next week so be on the lookout for that so yeah that's what i got going all right and uh currently episode three is underway um i just have to film my last two scenes and then start the editing process in which that should be completed hoping by Tuesday at the latest but we shall see and I know you guys have been patiently waiting and it's gonna get really good so make sure you check me out UFK Productions on YouTube and follow me on IG UFK Productions period Sims thank you Oh, uh, and then uh, D, besides uh, working on Jun's animation as this podcast, what you got going going for? <laughs> um, you might see a little fantasy theme short for me in the next few weeks. Other than that, animations. Oh, uh, for the fantasy thing, is it like a little clip or is it like more animations? Mm, it's like a a little episode, mini episode kind of thing. Should be around five minutes long. So, oh. like a mini, uh, kind of like a mini machinima? Yes. Awesome. We're looking forward to that. All right. Good. Good to hear that. And then, uh, as for me, I sent out lines to everyone already. I know some of you got them time done already. Good job, Pixarella. Um, and, Thank you. And, um,. Yeah, so basically right now I'm just waiting for the audio. Uh, most of the stuff is filmed for Enlin, um, so next episode should be out. I may release a little promo, I don't ever do that because I think they're a waste of time. That's just my opinion on it. Um, but I might actually get one out this week. Um, and look, after that, um, Unseen will probably be the next thing I'm working on, and then uh, Vamps Episode 2, because I know a lot of you have been wanting Episode 2 already. Um, so just kind of be patient with me on that. Look, the whole cast is still down, so we're all good. And, uh, yeah, that's all I got. Well, I wish I could say good job, Lou, but I haven't got my arms back yet, so. Oh, uh, well, I'm working on that also. Um, catch me in Gen series. That's coming out, uh, you saw Christmas, right? Uh, I said uh, hopefully mid-December, so yeah. Alright, well, I'll definitely have my lines in this week. So I'm almost done. I've been doing little bits and pieces. All right, and then on that note, uh, we're all going to do our closing remarks now. Um, Jen, what is your closing statement? Um, you guys have been real, you know what I'm saying? And um, uh, <coughs> check me out, Live Gen Red Sims Productions on YouTube. Also, follow me on Instagram, Twitter. I don't really fuck with Twitter, but, you know, Instagram, I'm on there. Um, give me a shout out or whatever. Follow, like my pictures or whatever. Don't follow me and unfollow me because I will find you and I'll unfollow your ass too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I forgot. I forgot. I, I am coming out with a new series called Imagine It. I found my, um, my, my male lead character. He's also a rapper. Thank you, Mo. You're uh, welcome, love. Him, so he's going to be, he's going to be also um introducing his own rapping into my series too so vhs the beast yeah so they'll give him a lot of uh, publicity and everything so he's he's all aboard so i'm you know and i got my old characters and pixel i hope you come aboard with this series too you know ma like you know you in there and lou i hope you come mm -hmm. aboard too d if you do voiceovers Come on, let your girl. Oh, God, let your girl. <laughs> 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 all right, that's all I got for y'all. <laughs> oh, what? All right. And uh, Pixel, what's your opening uh, closing statement? <laughs> oh, 
Well, um, yeah, so like I said, um, new episode of episode three coming out next week. Um, follow me on Twitter and Instagram, all Pixarella. Subscribe to my channel, Pixarella. Everything Pixarella. <laughs> I also have <laughs> I also have a Christmas special coming um either close to Christmas or maybe a little bit after Christmas, but um it's coming. So yeah. All right, did we lose Lou? <laughs> oh, my bad. I was on mute. My bad. Um, <laughs> all right. Uh, Mo. Um, just visit my page, UFK Productions. Um, and just check out some of the stuff that I have, especially Fade. And also make sure you check out uh, the Kita and Tanza Chronicles. It's a jump off of Fade, so they all connected. Um, and also to our listeners, we appreciate the love. We appreciate you guys tuning in. Um, let's go ahead and get that hashtag flowing sim tainment, not sim entertainment at Jennifer. <laughs> um, spelled S I M T A I N M E N T. That's pound sim tainment. Throw those tags, show your love, and we appreciate you guys listening. Yes. All right, all right, and Dee, thank you for being a special guest uh, on our podcast today. Any closing statements? Any closing statements? <laughs> no, I think we lost her. Oh, Dee, you saw her? Yes, I'm here. <laughs> all right, sorry about that. Uh, what's your closing statement? Um. Everyone needs to try Masumimo at least once. So these training days? Um, I, got uh, to bring two I don't know. <laughs> Alright, well, I like training day too. So, um, yeah, that's a great closing statement. And uh, as for me, um, yeah, like I said, uh, thanks for listening. Like I said, use this podcast. Uh, if you're working on the Shinemas, you can pull it in the background. You can also catch a replay at all our YouTube channels. That will be, the links will be in the description. And on that note, our cities need us, and goodbye. Bye. Bye. Bye, bye, bye. <laughs> oh, also, animation video coming out tomorrow, so look for that.